Hey there, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're going to explore one of the most fascinating natural phenomena, the tides. Have you ever wondered what causes the tides? Well, you're in the right place. Let's dive in. The tides are primarily caused by the gravitational pull of the moon and, to a lesser extent, the sun. The moon's gravitational force affects the earth, creating two tidal bulges on opposite sides of the planet. As the Earth rotates on its axis, different parts of the planet experience the gravitational pull of the moon, resulting in high tides and low tides. When an area is experiencing high tide, the water level rises, while during low tide, the water level recedes. The sun also exerts a gravitational force on the Earth, although it is about half as strong as the moon's gravitational force. When the gravitational forces of the moon and the sun align, we experience higher high tides known as spring tides. Conversely, when the gravitational forces are at right angles, we have lower high tides, known as neap tides. It's important to note that the geography of coastlines and the shape of ocean basins also play a role in the variation of tides around the world. Narrower channels and bays can amplify the height of the tides, while broader coastlines can result in more subtle changes in water levels. In conclusion, the tides are primarily caused by the gravitational pull of the moon and the sun on the Earth's oceans. The alignment of these forces, along with the geography of coastlines, determines the height and timing of tides around the world. Understanding the tides is not only fascinating but also important for activities such as boating, fishing, and coastal navigation. So next time you're at the beach, take a moment to appreciate the dynamic ebb and flow of the tides. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Let me know in the comments what your thoughts are on this topic.